Hi there, Jenny and I went to the Rabasanya Goodwill. I hadn't been there in a while. And the first thing that I spied was this Delft ashtray and I wanted to date it to see how old it was. And so I went to the website, the Delft website, and they have a page there that shows you the different back dates, the trademarks. And then there is a little two letter code on the right side and mine says DJ. So based on the DJ of the code, I know that mine is from 1990. And this is very helpful to help you date pieces if you're not quite sure how old they are. I was hoping that this would glow. It really wasn't giving off in much of any glow, so I left that there. This pot or planter was marked Mexico. I like the style and the, the design on it, but unfortunately it did have a chip right there on the edge. Ooh, that's some skull. Skull. Yeah. What is that made of? Paper mache? Yeah. Mm -hmm. right? Yeah. It's solid paper mache. Motion mug from 1982. Oh, they're cups. Oh, I wasn't expecting that. Else? They're creamers. I was <clears throat> I was thinking they were figurines, and then I, my finger hooked behind it, and I was surprised for a second. Huh. Oh. This before. This is from the um, museum. This is a reproduction. Like you get this at the Museum of Modern Art. Mm -hmm. It's a little. Mine didn't have the court glass tie. But. I've sold that before. <clears throat> this is three dollars, and this oh, it's pretty. Two ninety nine. This Goodwill is a little bit further than Shillington, and I used to go to this one before I knew that there was a Goodwill in Shillington. And it's a very smaller one. It has a, a small hard goods section, but I always fa found things when I went here on a more regular basis. I wouldn't find a ton of things, but I, there was always something that I could bring home with me. And today was not the exception. I found some really cute pieces. These pottery pieces were nice. I really like the look of the blue candle holder. It had a nice uh, color to it and style to it. One Mary, she is all by herself. Oh, dang, what's this? This is that uh, egg. Isn't um, that that? Yeah, his eyes. I forget his name. <laughs> but I know who we're talking about. Yeah, does it have a He's tab? adorable. It is cute. Look at him. Just the lazy, like the, the lazy egg. The lazy egg. He's a lazy egg. Yeah. <laughs> oh, he's a lazy boiled egg. Ah, there you go. <laughs> his little bottom. His butt. <laughs> his butt. <laughs> oh, there you go. There's his bottom. <laughs> Some hors d'oeuvre forks. Oh, Fenton. Look at that. Ten dollars. I wonder if they have a price for this. This doesn't have a price. The candle holder that I found is a transferware. It is not hand painted, and I couldn't find one that matched mine exactly. And I wonder if you know what it is, and if you could tell me in the comments below. I kind of think that it's it might be a monthly thing, maybe a birthday, flower, March, daffodils. I could be making this up, but I kind of think that's what it is. And I think it's from the 80s. I think I see an eight underneath the Fenton. I really like this boat. I wish there was more pieces. I would think that more pieces went with this originally, but I really like the brutalist look of it. I thought it was in really great shape. It's the, the little flag up there was a little bit bent, but it's just blowing in the wind. <laughs> so if you could help me out on that Fenton piece, I'd really appreciate it. This is really pretty. This is signed, $2.99. This is missing its lid. $2.99. What's that? $3.99. Cream canoe pan. Oh, it's to make it look like uh, Twinkies. It's funny, do you remember memories of, of those whimsical cakes you loved as a kid? Ugh, I hated Twinkies. I still don't like Twinkies. Huh? I still don't like Twinkies.
It was unfortunate that the lid was missing off of the coffee pot or chocolate pot. These were older hobbyist pieces. They were signed on the bottom. Uh, a very, very pretty design. Both of those decorative masks were marked Mexico. It reminds me of pottery that my dad used to bring back to my mom when he would go on business trips to Texas. This was marked Hager Florentine. I believe that this was used in florist shops. Jenny is pointing out the hot chocolate mugs to me. And then that fancy decanter was marked $9.99. And then over here we have a really cute soup mug with cats on it. And then another piece, I was trying to see what the markings on that was. Couldn't quite read it, but then I realized that there was a card inside. And I did put that back. It reminded me of a little cauldron, and that was $6.99. Chicken candle. It's $3.99. There's another chicken. Down here. Napkin holder. Oh, $9.99. Okay. From tops to a flag. Kitty cat. Oh, he's a broken ear. Oh, he's cute. <laughs> he's cute if he didn't have his broken ear. Imitating Poor little kitty. You're imitating the kitty. This was a bag of ta uh, tapestry thread, but it looked like it was just the thread and there was a pattern in there, but it, it looked like a snarly mess. So I did leave that there. This was impressive. This big piece, it was marked $9.99. That was really nice if you collect that decorative uh, metal stuff, but I don't really know much about the metal pieces. I like, all I know is to look for something that says sterling on it. These were cute. They reminded me of the RCA puppy dog. Uh, in master's voice but the eye and I almost got them but the eyeballs on this one was one was way smaller than the other one so I did leave that there this looks interesting $4.99 I think it was at Marshall's this is pretty that's a pretty cranberry piece some jardiniers here Matching jardiniers. Oh, I see a Russian, uh, Russian bird. That's neat. I like that. A little egg cup. This is Polish. This looks like it's from Poland. Can you open that for me? It's gonna be, yeah, this is a Polish one. But I would. I would be 99% sure that it was made in Poland. This big pot. A, B, C. Mila. Wait, what? We had $13.99 on that. I thought that was glass. It's not. This is plastic. This is Avon. Ooh, that's loud. That was White Barn. And this is White Barn. So candles. Santa Coca-Cola glasses here. Three of them for three dollars. So Christmas. It's a little dark. See if we can brighten it up. There we go. Oh, here's some. Uh, are these Lennox or are these fake Lennox? I'm thinking they're fake Lennox. You ready? What do you think? Real or fake? I don't know if it's real. Well, just pick. Fake. Okay. Boom. Oh, I made in China. I think they're supposed to look like the jeweled Lennox, but it's not. And then have this fancy. Look at that. Don't criticize your wife's judgment. Look who she married. <laughs> Get it? Oh, oh, oh. Here's a bag of bears. An angel. 
Look at this snowman. Look how he's, how he's sitting. <laughs> like he's bobsledding. Oh, look, there's some angel. What's that bunny angel? What's this? Um, little bunny angel and a dove. Oh, it's a little bag of Easter. That's a little dove. There's a clam bake with a turtle, Enchanted. Oh, the movie Enchanted right there. <laughs> Jenny spies it from the other side. Here's some bookcases. These are cute. These are $6.99. Oh, they're little French bulldogs. Aren't those little French bulldogs, Ingman? Yeah, I think so. Those are cute. Those are sweet. Ooh, what does peace and tranquility smell like? I think it's going to smell like flowers. Perfume. 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 It smells like soap. It's very, very light. It's not that bad. It's not terrible. How much is it? $2.99. Is there a puppy dog? Oh, there is a little, a little cavalier. Aww. A little cavalier puppy dog. I think they're cute. We're going to get those. That one's so dark. It's like the lights went out. <laughs> Stay light. Okay, take your jacket off. Okay, what was this? this is Valentine, 1973, Noritake Bone China, limited edition of a thousand. I think it's a little pomander thing or something. Interesting. This doesn't sell for very much, so we're gonna leave that there. And then there's this little tiny little sign. What's this interesting thing? I think someone made that. And then there are these for $6.99. A whole bunch of those. And then down here. Oh, it's a book cover. I thought it was a towel. And then we have this. Oh, she lost her head. It's a shame. Oh, that's plastic. Okay. Let's see what these are. Big painting. It's four ninety nine. It's interesting. Jenny sees it. Oh, this feels weird, but it's still cute. It feels weird, but it's cute. Three ninety nine. I wouldn't want that in my head because it feels really weird. Oh, it's cute though. But it's it? <laughs> it's a Christmas hat. Weird. <laughs> That's cute. <laughs> Good eye, Denny. I was like, what she's going for it. What'd she see? <laughs> This is going to wrap up our trip here to the Rabasanya Goodwill. I hope you enjoyed our trip here. Definitely we'll be back. And another place I'm definitely going to be back is this Mexican restaurant that we stopped at. The tortilla soup and the shrimp tacos. Highly, highly recommended. I was thinking about that tortilla soup for days afterwards. It was so delicious. Here's everything that I picked up on this trip to Goodwill. Coming up after the pictures here is a little bonus video, and I'm also going to add a preview of a video that we are going to drop tomorrow. I hope that you are having a great day. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see ya. We got mail. <laughs> is it the sweatshirts? It is. It's our sweatshirts. Yeah, okay. <gasps> there's, <gasps> there's mine. Jenny, here's your sweatshirt. Ooh, I like it. Oh <gasps> I like it because it looks like a marshmallow. That's what I thought. See, and they said it was pink and it, it has a, it's like light brown. Oh, oh it's, it's just like, what like I wanted. Toasted, yes. Toasted marshmallow. Look how cute you are. <laughs> oh, look at that. Like Jenny, want to show yours? Yeah, it's got, a shirt. That's mine. And Jenny got a blue one. Let me back up a little bit. Oh, it's so cute. Simple. Jenny got a blue tie-dyed one. And then, Jimmy, what did you get? Did you get a shirt or did you get a... I think... Oh, it you got a purple like bag. <laughs> oh, a, pur a purple sweatshirt. It smells like bag. <laughs> Look at that. All right. If you got yours, make sure you uh, tag me in on Instagram and show me what you got. I would love that. I would love to see what people picked out. We got sweatshirts. <laughs> Obviously. Look at that. Adorable. <laughs> <laughs>
And so we thought, well, we like food. We, it was <laughs> like, it, it, I mean, what a great deal. And with the holidays coming up, right. Hanukkah's coming up, uh, Christmas is coming up. Um, and I think the, these kind of presents are fun for people who like, they have everything. What should I get them? Mm -hmm.